what is going on youtube welcome back to another video on today's video we got this beautiful clone right here that we did this is one of the first clones we did uh came in for some work here's a little preview of everything we did big shout out to my little cousin Menyo for giving us a hand on this build right here so we're officially done with this bad boy right here so check it out and we got the burgundy ss clone in here and now we're blocking the whole truck taking care of some dents we're gonna fix the cladding. Working on this side as well. Big shout out to my little cousin Manito. You are dusty, way. Sunny. Where's your mask at, fool? So we got the SS clone in here. We're doing some body work on it. Stay tuned for this build. Got the hood over here. Blocking the whole hood. There's that bumper, rear bumper. So we pretty much got everything sanded. We just we can go ahead and circle all the imperfections, and we're taking care of that right now. And then we're gonna spot primer that, and then go from there. Little update on the SS clone right here, the burgundy clone. We're finalizing all the bodywork. We got the panels pretty much straight right here, straightened up. We are getting ready to pull the bed back off. Big shout out to Meñito. Say what's up to you too, cuz. What's up? For helping me out on this build right here. We're just finalizing all the bodywork. We are gonna pull the bed off to get behind the cab. There's quite a bit of damage right here in the back still. We still gotta take care of this right here. The back. And we're gonna spot primer this section probably tomorrow. So we could continue to, be, to block the bodywork. But uh, there's a little update right here. Hopefully next time you guys see this, it'll be fully primer. Well, she's getting there. Where really they took the covers up the wheels because we flipped it. But she's getting there. I want to take this back. Okay, we're getting ready to shoot some primer on the bed. We just blocked it, got them blocking it. And then we're getting the cab ready. It is gonna be in hella hot today, so. We'll probably shoot it later on today, tonight, or tomorrow morning. But the cap's almost there. We ended up blending the cap corners. The the cladding corner, so you won't be able to tell there was a cladding there. But the both sides. We did take care of a big old den that I had right here. I ended up pulling it out. Fat old den right there. The cab was pushed in. It made the bed look weird. But she's almost there. On the bottom, on the whole door, whole fender. And block that. And then hopefully I'll get it and shoot the whole truck. For those that follow me on IG and Instagram, you guys know the process. I do little uh, clips of every process we're doing to this truck. It's kind of hard to be working and recording at the same time. But y'all know the work that went behind it. So 
we just shot some primer, high bill primer on the bed. We're about to guy coat it so we can stop blocking it. So we just lay some guide coat. And we should start blocking this thing tomorrow. Block this thing right now. Gotta wash it and give it a second coat of primer. Little cousin over there helping me out, tape the truck. the final results right there big shout out to my little helper over there manual you already know it she's almost ready for primer I'm about to shoot the bed one more time over there and then go from there not supposed to be that hot today in California, so hopefully the weather don't fuck with me. There she is. Last time you guys see it in Burgundy.
this a small or light, what you call light coat. So we're gonna block that one more time and then respray it. Same over here. That's gonna help us find other little dings and ding dents that are left behind. Promote that bumper. One in the sun. So right here we got the whole cab already in fresh primer. We still gotta primer the bumper, but we're gonna promote it first. We're gonna plastic promote it so the primer can stick to it. And then we are gonna guide core the whole truck to find the high and low spots on it. and give it a final coat. So I'm just gonna do a light guide coat so I could block the whole thing again with the 220. And the bed, the bed's already where it's gonna be at. So when I put the bed back on the cap for the final primer, I'm gonna slightly guide coat it. And leave it like that for for final process. We did use this primer as a sealer, so the tr whole truck is sprayed as a sealer, which I think is better. And we still have the hood over there, the hood and the rear bumper, which is over here. We still gotta sand that one down and the grill. The grill was in the painted corners. This already promoted, which in the edge this in primer those. But yeah, the bed wouldn't leave it like this already. That's it. This guy caught it a little bit. Very, very light. There's the final results. Second coat of primer. Block the whole thing. Hey, get away. It's fresh still.
So we just got the bed back on there. We're fixing to put the front lights right now on there. Got the little air duct bent in the bottom of the bumper as well. You already know how to do my little signature. SS stencils on the back too. But we're moving along on this build. We are gonna be shooting the bed liner a little later though. I wanna give it uh, the primer some time to dry and cure before we start taping all around there. We're all done with the bumper as well. We already got the hood back on the truck. Get a little SS stencil on there. So we just got the air ducts installed, both sides, on the SS bumper. And we got the grill back on there. We just need the hood and the rear bumper. We'll be done with this project. I took her out of the shop, that way I send the hood in there. Don't get all dusty and get overspray. It's just looking good. The wheels are intros, they are 24s. Put the air ducts in there. The center one. on the back are a little bit wider because I think the dip is cut yeah it's cut the dip is cut for, for the big wheels to fit under but it looks pretty good this thing had quite a bit of a body work on there so we went we wouldn't go ahead and strain everything up right here and did our body work on here Let me know what you guys think. And there it is for this video. Hope you guys like it. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And I'll catch you guys up in the next one.